on a St. John's river ship cruise and lunch with the Village Vets Corvette Club, and there's the main office that we found when we arrived there, and over to my right here is this beautiful paddle-wheel ship, and the three levels, and it's absolutely fantastic. Those are the wheels spinning in the back. I look really, really great. I had to show you this one, this one little take here. It's a houseboat. Can you imagine that? An actual houseboat with pontoons. It's crazy. I think you put it in the marina. I don't think you want to be sailing that out in the ocean. <laughs> Corvettes are arriving. The gang from the Village Vets Corvette Club is arriving in their beautiful Corvettes. All ready to go on a nice sail. And a beautiful day it was. It's a four hour trip. We had a great time. And uh, here's the crowd from the Village Vets Club all ready to board the ship and get rolling. Okay, so we've got the pivoting point we're doing right here. So we point the ship out of the harbor. So it's rotating around from left to right. Very clever. And uh, just about all the way pointed out. So now we've got both pedals going uh, pretty much the same direction. And we're headed out into the lake. And once we get into the lake, then we'll pass under a couple of bridges, and we will then be on the St. John's River. So here we are going out of the harbor and out into the big, huge lake. This lake is huge. But before we do uh, the one of the bridges and everything, uh, let's uh, go to my interview with uh, Captain Austin, who is the captain of this wonderful vessel. So here's a look at uh, our uh, interview. Here we are with Austin, the man who is the captain of this ship. <laughs> wow, look at all. I gotta take a look here. Oh my goodness me. Look at all that. I was noticing you were, it seemed like you were pivoting off the mooring. Yeah, so um, the, that back set of pilings back there, perfect. we have a little bracket on the now stern you're... that we get that lined up on, push up on the piling and rotate out of there. Yeah, beautiful. Oh very, yeah. Very, I <laughs> thought that was very clever. Oh yeah. Very clever. So about how fast we're going? Uh, right now we're going about four and a half knots and then uh, going across the lake here. Once we get rolling, we'll probably be going about five and a half to six around there. Okay. Nice, comfortable. Oh yeah. Very pleasant. So you do this every day? Just about, yeah. Just yep. about every day? Five days a week. Great. Really, this has got to be a tough job. I mean, oh, <laughs> cruising on I the just air. dread coming here you every must be day. You must, have to, you must have to take stress pills every yeah. day. <laughs> <laughs> and then once we get on the river, it's, uh, that's, that's where you're going to see all the good stuff. All the alligators. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. So we're now passing under the bridge, just passed under a bridge, and we're now on the St. John's River. We're out of the lake, and we're in, up the river, so to speak. Uh, some people uh, shows the dining area where we were sitting, uh, the Corvette Club, and it was really great. And just down below us was another group, and there's entertainment and there's information going on all the time. Uh, all sorts of things, uh, telling you about what's all around you, uh, that was really great. And uh, live music going on all the time. And adult beverages uh, served throughout the entire cruise. But uh, anyway, here we go with, uh, I love this paddle wheel thing. Uh, it's just a wonderful trip. Very, very comfortable and relaxing trip. And uh, a lot of lily pads along the side there that almost looked like they were specially made. Especially for people, <laughs> they look great. And once in a while, I see a guy in a jet ski, and uh, it looks like a lot of fun too. Cruising right along, they're going in the opposite direction, so a lot of fun. And this was a little uh, boardwalk of some sort we saw too that looked interesting. Along the way, we saw some beautiful homes along the way, as you can see. Not a lot of them. And now we're headed back, and um, here's one of the bridges we have to go back under. We're coming out of the St. John's River, 
We've got one more bridge, actually two more bridges to go under. This one is a drawbridge, pretty cool. I thought that was quite interesting. And uh, just a beautiful, beautiful trip. I mean, just an absolutely delightful trip. And uh, we, my wife and I enjoyed it very, very much. There's one of the youngsters down there that was on board ship, cute as a button, uh, with the mommy and daddy. My wife Patty's down there talking to him. Now this is the, the last two bridges we go. I think this is uh, Interstate 4, which is um, not the most highly regarded interstate in the state of Florida. <laughs> they usually like to stay off it. So we're passing under these two bridges. We're back in the lake and we are headed home after having a terrific, terrific journey. Terrific food, terrific service, a wonderful captain who kept us um, pointed in the right direction all the way. And now we're entering into the harbor. There's some pigeons flying around, which I thought was kind of interesting as they flew around in a circle for two or three times. Very, very uh, different. You don't see that very often. But anyway, everything was great. <clears throat> we had a great time. And uh, like I said, everything was five star. Everything was just an absolute pleasure. And I'm just so thrilled that we took the, took the trip. So now that, speaking of the trip, the tricky part is how do you get this boat in sideways? Um, <clears throat> they're gonna go in and they're gonna grab one of the uh, lines <clears throat> on the front of the ship, which you see what this gentleman is doing right here. He's gonna grab this line here, then he's gonna go aft, and he's gonna grab another line in the aft part of the boat. And I'm thinking, boy, this is amazing how we pulled this right in. How did this guy do it? It's absolutely amazing. Well, on the other side of the boat, there was this little pusher boat, <laughs> and he came out and he, he uh, pushed against the side. I see that big rubber thing on the front. He pushed against the side of the boat and got us into the dark. Wonderful day, great trip.